Hey guys, Marlo back again with yet another toy review. This time I just wanted to do a quick unboxing and share this video of the Hot Toys 1-6 scale Avengers Age of Ultron Quicksilver. Now this figure came out a while ago and because of my move I wasn't able to pick him up and frankly he wasn't a figure I really wanted to you know run out and get right away anyways and it's been about a year at least since this figure came out and I'm glad I waited because he's one of those figures that apparently not a lot of collectors really wanted and I was able to get this recently for a pretty good deal it was hundred forty dollars shipped so you can't really beat that um, I believe the figure retailed for over two hundred so you know hundred forty dollars shipped is a great deal in my opinion and you know you can't get a lot of uh, one six scale figures at that price point anyways let alone, let alone any uh, Hot Toys figures so give you guys a quick look at the box nothing too special about it uh, the front slip comes right off like that and reveals the figure inside He doesn't have a lot of accessories from what I understand. Looks like just a few hands and the display base. And that's about it. So another reason why this figure wasn't so popular. And also, you know, spoiler alert, if you haven't seen the movie yet, he doesn't make it to the end. <laughs> but anyways, he's still kind of cool to have. And I wanted to complete my Avengers Age of Ultron collection by adding him to the ever-growing collection. So let me take him out of the package and give you guys a quick look. And inside the package, you can see the figure there. Again, not too many accessories, just the hands and the display base underneath. And really quick, a decent likeness to the actor Aaron Taylor Johnson. Looks pretty nice. And if you're wondering why it looks like this, I did get the figure uh, used or pre-owned. So that's why I got a good deal, but it looks practically new. It, you know, was just displayed for a brief time, and yep, got a good deal on it. So let me get him out and post up for you guys. All right, and out of the box, this figure is really pretty cool in my opinion. Simple, but pretty cool. I mean, it's Quicksilver from the movie, and what more could you ask for? Let's start with the head sculpt. Again, a really great lightness to... Aaron Taylor Johnson, if I can get it to focus. Really nice paint work in the hair and details there. So I think that looks pretty cool. And the outfit itself is pretty nice. See some of the details there in the pants and the shoes. Whoops. Standard Age of Ultron display case, or not display case, but uh, display stand with Quicksilver there on the silver placard. The extra hands, he comes with three extra sets of hands for both sides, left and right, and some extra wrist pegs in case you break them. So a really nice figure. Has some nice pivoting at the ankles so you can get him in all kinds of cool running poses and he poses really nicely. He has, you know, really great articulation so he's one of those figures that you know, he doesn't have much to him but as far as posability he's going to be a nice figure to pose. So 
So let me set him up next to his sister and give you guys another look at that. All right, and here's Quicksilver pose next to his sister, Wanda, the Scarlet Witch. Just a basic pose there, just kind of to sh show you guys a, a quick size comparison and how they look together, and they look really cool. So it's nice to have them both in the collection if you want to have the Avengers team, even though, you know, he doesn't really make it to the end of the film. Still really neat to have. So I recommend, you know, if you guys don't have this figure yet, yet uh, try to look on eBay or something like that and see what kind of deals you can get. Because there's a lot of good deals out there and a lot of people don't really seem to like this figure. So he's one of those overlooked figures, which I think is pretty cool. So anyways, I hope you guys liked the video. It's not much to it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, like the video, share the video, and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep on collecting. Take care.